Hello everyone, in this video we are going to be adding images to our app or our windows in our app. So let's create either create a new project and just delete everything inside the app.js or just have your project you were using to, I don't know, play around with practice and just delete the app.js so that we could start fresh. Now, as usual, let's create a window. Uh, tie.ui.create window and inside it because I can, I'm going to change the background color to my not favorite, but I like this color yellow. And add a view, tie.ui. Uh, not create, create view, nothing inside. And we are going to be creating a variable called image. And just like view label buttons and stuff, we are going to be creating a new, uh, or there's no new in the word, but create image view. And inside this, we are going to have options. Uh, so the image is going to be uh, cat.jpg. I love cats. And let's change the width to about 200 because my cat image is bigger than the screen of the iPhone simulator. If we change or declare the, whoops, thank God I noticed that, the width or the height, it's going to like adjust the uh, size of your image without making it like really uh, fat or thin and long and stuff. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's add our image to a view. So view dot add image, and then let's add our view to our win. Win dot add view, and then make sure to win open win. And before we do that, we need to put our image, in my case it's a cat image, into our resources. So I in my whoops in my desktop. Come on. Yep. In my desktop I've got an image of a really cute cat. So all you need to do usually is over here in your app explorer just drag the image inside somewhere around here. And it says uh, select how should we import in the project. I'm just going to copy it. So there we go. We have the cat.jpg inside our project. Now make sure to save your uh, app.js and let's run our simulator. There we go. And we've got our iPhone. Yep. Oh, I love cats. It's so cute. But I've got cat allergies, so I can't have them at home, which sucks. So yeah, we've got a window with a background color of yellow, as usual. And we have added an image to our window, or technically to our view, which is then added to our window, uh, of an image of a cat. I just googled cat in Google image and came up with this and we changed the width of it which automatically changed the height so that it's like adjusted automat uh, to scale if that's a white word so that the cat's not like tall and skinny or short and fat uh, let's close this simulator and inside this image what you can do is instead of having this uh, cat.jpg I'm just going to write it as a comment because I'm not going to do it uh, what we could do is inside this cat.jpg or no inside this image instead of cat.jpg what you could do is have like uh, HTTP www dot I don't know like image library dot com slash cat jpeg or something like that or you could actually uh, bring an image from the internet as long as you have the URL and it displays normally like that cat image I dragged and dropped into my uh, project folder although you in this case you have to have your internet connection so I still recommend using this local image cat thing so thanks for watching and I'll see you later